Hey guys, Logan Rook to Season 7, Episode 3 of Criminal Minds. Real quick, everyone's always asking me, what are your top favorite shows of all time? Not shows on the channel, but top favorite shows of all time. And this is the list right here. We got Lost, Game of Thrones, 12 Monkeys, Prison Break, The Walking Dead, Criminal Minds, Black Sails, Vikings, Sense8, and American Horror Story. Um, that's where we're at so far. Um, obviously, there are new shows coming out. I have not watched that many shows because I do this. Uh, and yeah, so um, Lost is over. It's the greatest show of all time. If you don't like it, you have no taste. Uh, Game of Thrones is amazing. It's obviously House of the Dragon is also thrown in there with Game of Thrones. So, you know, same with The Walking Dead. The Walking Dead is not just The Walking Dead. It's everything that is a part of The Walking Dead. Uh, Criminal Minds is a show that's still going on. Some of these shows are still going on, so they have a chance of moving up even further on the list. Some of these shows, some people have never heard of. 12 Monkeys, one of the greatest shows of all time. Could easily be up here at 2. They're kind of really close. Uh, some of these shows, you know, might fly under the radar since 8, 12 Monkeys. Uh, American Horror Story is one of those ones that y'all are probably shocked. It's on your top 10. Yeah, uh, it's it's got it's got some amazing seasons and a lot of weird stuff, and I like it. So, but yeah, obviously there are some shows that don't qualify on this list that I would say are shows that you should probably check out. Um, there are some comedy shows that I would not classify on that list, but I would love them. I love them so much. Uh, Rick and Morty is is one of those. Star Wars, obviously Star Wars as a whole, Marvel as a whole, I don't classify those as, you know, those top ten lists because they're not, they're different, you know? Like, Star Wars is this giant, massive franchise, you know, with, like, all these different movies and shows and all that, and same with Marvel, so you can't really, I'm not going to throw those in a list like this, but go check out some of those some of those shows. We're gonna do a lost rewatch on this channel. It's gonna be the first time we ever do a rewatch on the channel, so that'll be fun. It'll be different kinds of videos. Anyways, we're up to season seven, episode three of Criminal Minds. Criminal Minds is sitting there at six. Will it make top five by the end? There's a good chance. Here we go. Power on. Oh boy. Is that a gunshot? Hey, bro. Thanks for the referral. Paint the Smith house today. This guy's going through something. Why is everybody... Oh well, you probably are looking at them very weirdly. What? What is with this neighborhood though? Why is everybody looking outside? Heads up. Someone's got eyes on us. Oh. We need to come in. Is he undercover? What? What? Change your hair. No? Really? Hey, just give me a sec. What do I have this morning? Okay, we've loaded into 1230 and rescheduled lunch with Colt. I can't, I've got a okay. big hand. <laughs> huh? Fine, put her on. Hi, sweetheart. Say what? I know, I wish I could be there too. Welcome to work. Okay, break a leg, honey. Break a leg. Oh! Damn! Oh, look a 
get you spoiling me. Thank you. Where's yours? Oh, I quit caffeine. I'm trying to relax more. You don't relax too much. You got 10 hours to take down an arrest procedure training to recertify. Since when? Princess, you've been away. Oh, yeah. I guess I can't complain. <laughs> well, especially not to your trainer. Oh, you're doing it? Don't get too excited. I'm about to put you through the ringer. You can believe that. It's payback. <laughs> Workplace massacre this morning at Cinelock Incorporated. That's in Charlottesville, which is practically our own backyard. A gun and a knife. It's highly unusual. Could be two killers. That would be the first time for no. a workplace killing. Unless Their he's... This is internet security for corporations. They didn't have video surveillance. Multiple he's personality. They're in a new building. They didn't have time to set up their system yet. Any unhappy clients? Or a domestic situation among the employees? No, no. But your friendly neighborhood genius girl will find out. Our oh, bottom line is a mass killing is a flashy show of force. It's a way to become known. Which is why suicide, often by cop, is usually part of the plan. A new company providing internet security. After the news broke, half the town called in sick. Understandable. The media's in a frenzy. A press briefing from you guys would calm the town. Colton sick. Of as soon as we make our assessment. Shock they didn't just close. So what do we know about the missing employee so far? You said the CEO's office was ransacked? Yes, mm -hmm. not the office. JJ. Personal there, looking for something. This is the first victim we found, Nathan Munns. You have to be physically fit or at least intimidating enough to subdue so many people. Well, if this were highly premeditated, you would have brought enough ammunition to kill everyone. Unless he had a single target. He had a single target. Witnesses. Yeah, the target was the yeah, CEO, and then, and then he was, all right, I'm just going to kill everybody else. Similar, yeah. The sub's looking for an object, an old record, something not on a computer. Huh. Rossi, check this out. So, uh, Warner was worried enough about his safety to be armed. And he didn't have time to go for his gun or didn't perceive the threat yeah. to be immediate. Something else used to be here. Another picture frame. Could it be One's like some PTSD shit? Victim number three was over here. Oh. Victim number two, right here. Did like did they serve together? Right Adam Warner was killed first. Looks that way. Which means the unsub made it all the way. We've seen something like this before, like it like wasn't a threatening. That's something triggers a PTSD moment to where he. He could have been the missing employee. He may have taken that photo from his office. He was in it. He like, Why snaps. Why would an employee be interested in Cinelux contracts? Maybe this is about one client. He could be after specific company information. You got another motive besides killing. No. What's this about? There's a situation. What sort of situation? I'll tell you about it when I see you in the meantime. Don't answer your phone or you go, okay? Why? I'm on my way there now. What? That's always come up, and I need to know that you and Allie are safe, okay? Call me. What is going on? I don't get his motive. It's clean and fast. They all took two 45s to the chest, except for Adam Werner. That was the first one. He took one to the head. He took four body shots and one to the head, execution style. Definite overkill. Somebody was angry with the boss. Somebody with hunting skills. Or a law enforcement background. Military. Mom, Dad. Hey, look. There you are. Mother's upstairs. She was worried that something happened. It's good to see you, buddy. What have you done to my father? What are you talking about? I'm right here. <laughs> I'm right here. He's paranoid. Oh, he's paranoid. Is this about the mission? What mission? Oh, and he's got... Oh, no! <laughs> what have you done to my father? <laughs> oh, oh, no. He's having a you know, break. I love my lamp, and everyone else is crazy happy with their service. No complaints logged online. What? Zero. I'm talking every high tech blog, every chat room, glowing accolades. No one had anything contrary to say about Cinelock. Not that I would violate privacy laws to check, she says, but the answer is no. So Cinelock is clean. Mm -hmm. As a whistle. Which reminds me, you know how to whistle, don't you? You just put your lips together and blow. I love it when you talk old movies. Later, baby girl. We've located John Owen, the missing employee. He's been at a Doctor Who convention in San Diego since Saturday. It was a scheduled vacation. A Doctor Who? What? Paul, see, this supposed to be an awesome convention. 
So if it wasn't oh, someone the... connected to the workplace, who is it? Okay, I, I know that. Given the precision of the kills, it could be someone with a military background. Or a professional hired by a business competitor. A uh, hitman would just kill Warner, killing the entire I was thinking office. something else, and then I was like, a what? Oh. Warner was a Navy veteran, the, the, he had DAA move, contracts, the, he had close ties series. to the military. Could be someone from his past, harboring an old sure. grudge. He most likely will kill again, either himself or others, very soon. Did he kill his parents? What do you know about Gerardo Falls? Nothing. Is this because of Jenna? What did you do to Jenna? Look, you see, this I'm begging you. Is this your last chance you told me we're Mark and Barry Dolan on? I'm Mark Dolan! I'm your father for the love of God! Please! trying to mask the sound of the gunshot? It could be, or he was torturing them with sound. Why were they bound and gagged in the closet? Why not just kill them right away? He's going. Maybe he was trying to get information from her. Oh, what? Go ahead, go see your own speaker. He's okay, not okay. Okay, what if Dolan was the same unit as our CEO, Adam Warner? That would be the 212th. We need to bring her in for protective custody. Get the interviewer, send local PD, and have our nearest unit meet them. Done and done. Okay, it looks like he served 13 years. I have a hard time believing we're going to arrest this guy without him dying. He was a biotech company. He was never a Cinelock employee. We separated from his wife about a year ago, but that's a bit far back to be a trigger. Yeah, well, something had to have happened. He's unstable. He's on a rampage of some kind. Francis, this was a close-knit family. Look at him. They oh, my God. How bad would his disorder have to be to make him kill his own parents? Bad. He's got to think that he is in... He's in some kind of mission right now. Hodge Dolan's been going through this. Like old mementos and journals from his days in the service. He didn't come here just to kill his parents. He came to get something. He's on some sort of mission. God, that breaks my heart. The car's washed, spotless inside. No paint separation or rust. I agree. The Navy's in his blood. He would never let that go without getting it. Oh, y'all see the guy just standing there? I'll look across to your brother's place, Jeff, for any recent accidents. So, Dolan left us a day like he was take watching us. Car. He was smart enough to know it'd be tracked. Just got word of the local PDs at the wife and daughter's house. What is Someone's going on? Someone's unpredictable and he's on the rampage. We need to go wide. We need to get the profile of the press. What's the... The Dolan is a Navy veteran we believe is suffering from PTSD. A recent trauma may have triggered this. Yeah, but He's what? experiencing pathological disassociation. Despite his mental state, he has extreme survival skills. Right now, we believe he's within a 250-mile radius of Roanoke. He believes that he is on a mission, and if threatened, he will kill. So if you see him, stay away and notify the authorities. All units, that's right. Sir, oh, so I need you to stop right there. 14, what's your status? This is 14 shutting down Lindley Road now. Copy. One thing that's been bothering me is the first victim, Adam Werner. You have to show extreme sacrifice, risk life and limb to win the second highest medal of valor. So what did he do during peacetime to deserve it? So Garcia discovered part of the military records were encrypted. I just got the complete file from the Pentagon. They were involved in over 20 highly classified missions. Which missions were in 2000? Uh, only one. Operation Dorado Falls. See what you can find out about it. Oh okay. boy. It changes the profile. Definitely. How so? Navy SEALs are screened carefully for vulnerability to PTSD. They're resistant to it. Okay, so why would a trained Navy SEAL kill his... I didn't know that. ...officer and his own parents? Dolan just evaded a roadblock near his wife's house. They searched the surrounding area. What? And a wonderful father, but I always felt he was more married to the Navy than me. You weren't a priority to him? I don't know anybody Somebody in the Navy. once told me all Navy SEALs had a bolt hole, a secret location outside the country where they had another or identity and bank account set up. And I asked Luke about it once, and he didn't deny it. Is Daddy going to be okay? Uh, probably not. Okay, 
so it turns out 6.20 Friday night, Dolan got in a car accident in Bethesda. It must have been after he dropped off his dog. He suffered minor injuries. He refused medical treatment. Well, his wife said he was fine when he left her. Ah, uh, it had to have been the accident. accident. Uh, normal. Field sobriety test came up negative. What? Yeah, I wouldn't rule out drug use. Could be an aneurysm or a brain tumor. So we don't know what's going on. One thing's on. for sure, he's having a mental breakdown, but what the specific features of it? He's not living in a past time and place. He's living in the present with capacity and intelligence to evade law enforcement. Oh my. What, what is he doing? I, I, I don't know. I don't, I mean, I... Honey, if it wasn't PTSD, up? I don't know what it How is. Did the movie starting and missing Robert Mitchum. When I left, tell me where my family is. He looks so different. He took my husband. Boy, he was bleeding and he dragged him out. Yes, Someone from the army helping? Hey, Ma'am, listen to me. The FBI is in charge of looking for your husband, but I need you to try to remember what Lou Dolan said. I can't. It was terrorist. Yes, you can't just close your eyes. I know I can't. Ma'am, I believe that you can't just listen to the sound of my voice and go, just relax and breathe. Plenty of women would have no problem listening to the sound of his voice. What you <laughs> before he broke into your house? I was in the kitchen. pouring a drink for my husband. How the hell should I know? I don't even know you. Don't play dumb. You replaced him. Does he think your husband did something to them? He says you replaced them. You replaced, replaced them with dead. Does he mention Dorado Falls? Yeah. Yes. This is about Dorado Falls, isn't it? And gaslighting. Dorado Falls? You're gaslighting. He's person. paranoid. The mission. Who's your commanding he officer? He thinks. He thinks. Where are you keeping Jenna and Alan? Where's my family? He was calm until he, he thinks asked about that his family. They've created a whole new life for him and it's not real. Basically, the neural connection between the visual cortex and the emotional center of the brain becomes severed so that looking at a loved one doesn't elicit the same emotional response one would expect. Could that have ha happened in the accident? And the interesting thing is that the auditory connection remains intact, so that if they were to hear a loved one speak and not see them, they'd think that they were real. What causes this syndrome? It's unknown in 60% of the cases, but the rest have an organic cause, such as tumor or head trauma. He was in a car, car accident. accident. People with delusional disorders don't all become killers, though. He murdered his best friend and his parents because he believed they were imposters. So if he were to see his wife and daughter, the results would be deadly. Dolan kidnapped the general and didn't kill his wife because he had never met them before. Yeah. yeah. Might be another reason. Were you picking the morals when you gave the go-ahead on Dorado Falls? I told you that wasn't me. You're a liar. This country's at war and Dorado Falls is nothing but a speck on their radar. No one even remembers. I remember. What are you going to do with me? Trade you for my wife and child. And if that doesn't work, I'll kill you. You're not a Navy SEAL, you're a disgrace! Oh, this is bad. How close are you to getting Dolan? Can't the BAU do this on their own? We could. But you're helping speed things up. You're smart enough to see the upside, I'm sure. You help, and it goes well, you get your ticket punched. You don't, and it goes south. Well, weather's not too bad outside the Beltway. You know why Dolan's so worried about this mission? I have no idea. Weather complications? We need to know who Luke was closest to. His father. <laughs> that doesn't help. He killed him. I knew your dad, Mark. We were in boot camp together at Paris Island. He's a good man. Still triangulating a location. Hold on. Hold on. Now we can talk, but first I need to know that General Milgram is safe. He's alive, if that's what you mean. Do you think we're holding them? I saw you take my wife and child. What have you got, Christine? Getting closer. We're the warehouse district. Stand by. Please, stand by. Got it. 3352 Spring Street. Release the general, and then we can talk I don't about think he's your family. Get out of there alive. He's innocent. So we think. Besides, I didn't start this. Start what? Dorado Falls. 
Well, why don't you tell us your side of the story? You first. A South African diplomat was selling nuclear secrets to Iran. So what's the big secret? There is a man who was scheduled to Iran lives were lost, but there's been far worse missions. His mind chose Gerardo Falls to build a conspiracy around. Ah. Garcia, it's an empty lot with a cell phone repeater. Give me a rundown of the buildings in the area in the years that they were built. All over it like cat hair on a sofa. BTW, I can usually <laughs> locate a cell phone within three meters, but sometimes there are circumstances beyond my control, like physical barriers blocking a signal, not being in a satellite's direct line of sight, which bounces a signal to a repeater. Garcia, tell me you've got something. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yes, I have something. There they is a there. hotel built in 74 oh, that right. is scheduled for a demo. More GPS signal interference. Exact address The is tiny details Chicago. bother me, but... Yeah, Hope. Intel failed to identify two children aboard the boat. Oh. There was a chance to abort. Did he actually want us to go ahead? Did someone in the DSA two children die? I never knew it was a number until now. Negative red echo. The operation is a go. I repeat, the operation is a go. You had to shoot those kids, didn't you? They saw us, they would have blown the mission. They were witnesses. Just like everyone at cinema. Ah. They tried to buy Adam with the Navy Cross, but it didn't work, so they've replaced him with an imposter. And now they're taking my family one by one. I'll make you an offer. Oh, no. You let Milgram go, and I'll take his place. I don't want you, I want my family. Because I'm not just the guy behind the desk. I was a Marine with boots on the ground just like you. I know what you've been through. I want you to get your family back. All right. Miss Hutchin Morgan. That's terrifying that that's that can happen. Right now. You can get in a car accident and just, like, not recognize your freaking loved ones. That's probably very rare. He's still alive. Guys, get him out of here. Now, where the hell is Donald? Yeah, use the radio to mask the sound of his movements. We're on the move. Oh, no. Oh. I thought he 